Thank you so much for stopping by my channel and checking out this video. Today's topic is talking about other people's opinion and doing what you want to do and just going with it without having to listen to other people's opinion. Sometimes we dream of something and we want to do something so bad and then we have this idea in our head and this dream that we create that we want to do and we want to pursue but then sometimes when we go and we tell other people they're just like no nah, you can't do that that's ridiculous no you can't do that and they just kind of like put barriers in your dream so you kind of push back and push back and push back and then you you're just like okay maybe they're right maybe I can't do it maybe this is stupid and then you just throw away your dream so I'm here to tell you, stop doing that. Stop listening to what other people are saying. And I know for me, finding out God's purpose for me, I still don't know it yet and I'm still on my journey to finding that out. But I know that one thing is that I wanna help people and I wanna encourage people and I wanna inspire people and I wanna tell people not to give up and I want others to continue their walk with God and just keep going and not to give up. And for me, this is something I wanted to do. This is something I feel like I'm called to do and I just want to inspire others and everything about this I love. I love the idea of being able to make a video and putting it out there and hoping that somebody will see it and it will inspire somebody. Anybody who's feeling hopeless, anyone who's feeling down, anyone who doesn't have anyone telling them, you know, don't give up, you can do it. And it's just something I want to do. But the thing is, it's taken me such a long time to do this because of other people's opinion. I've for so long been making videos like this and then never posting it. I've been holding back doing this because of other people's opinion, of other people's judgments. I've always been afraid of people making fun of me because of it and being like, wow, you're such a loser. Like, why would you do that? Or wow, that's so stupid. Or that's so boring. Like, you know, and I'm like, okay, maybe they're right. So I would never do it. I would just film a video here in my room and then I'll delete it. And I feel like they've won. Everyone who's always brought me down because of it is one and I lost at the end of it because I didn't get to do what I Felt like was my calling and was something I really wanted to do I couldn't do it because of other people's opinion, you know and Throughout life whether we're in middle school high school college or even in the work field We are constantly told no and we are constantly told you can't do it or we are constantly told you are too skinny, you are too fat, you are too this. We're never perfect enough in other people's eyes. That's the thing. We will never satisfy other people. But the one person who we are perfect in their eyes is God. And as long as we are perfect in His eyes, and He is a creator, He created us, and He thinks that we are perfect, and He loves us. And He saved, He sent His only Son, Jesus, to save us from our sin. That's how much He loved us. So if the one and only creator thinks that you are perfect and that you can do it, there is nothing stopping you from doing what you need to do. Everybody here, everybody has something that they want to do. And when they're told that you can't do it and you, you're not perfect enough or you are not good enough, stop. Don't listen to them. You know, in your mind, be like, well, God thinks I'm perfect enough, so I'm gonna do it anyways, you know? You are satisfied with yourself. There's nothing that can stop you. There's no one's opinion that can stop you. Once you learn not to care anymore, it's just, you feel like a weight has gone off your shoulders. You feel like, okay, okay, I'm not so scared. I can do this, and you go with it. Anything that you dream of being, and someone tells you you can't do it, and someone tells you, well, you're a girl, you can't do that, or you're too weak, or you're not fast enough, you're not pretty enough, you're not this enough, you're not that enough, do it. I encourage you to do it. To chase your dream, work hard, and do it. Because that's what you want to do. Not what everybody else wants you to do. So if they don't know anything about your life, and they don't know what you go through on a daily basis, then their words should not affect you. Do not let fear stop you from doing what God has called you to do. Because you're letting fear win. And you are much stronger than that. And you can do it. So, take me as an example. This is a big step for me. 
being able to post this so everyone can see. And at first I was very nervous, but I feel like this is something I need to do. So do something this week. Do something this week that you are a little afraid of doing. Do something this week like text your crush back or um, talk to somebody who you've never usually talked to or do something, try something new that you never did before, that used to scare you all the time. Just do something that you can say, whoa, that was something I was afraid of and now I can do it. Face your fears. Don't live in it. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys. It means the world. If you can like and subscribe and comment down below any other videos you would like to see for next time, I promise I will try to be uploading more frequently. And feel free to write to me and tell me what's going on with you and if you need any advice or help because I'm learning too. I'm learning all of this. So, yeah. Hopefully you guys like this video and I'll see you next time. Bye.